morning. Good We're at morning. breakfast. Good morning. This is already like day five, and we have not looked at the camera since day one, two. <laughs> one or two. So today we are going to keep you posted, vlog, and yeah, we need to clean the lens. Walking back to the room. Got swap out our books. Swap out our books. Easy gravel. Jesus, I'm not feeling great. But I'm feeling better. I know, it's so good. Uh, yesterday, you should have seen me. It was a roughie. It was a roughie. She's gonna be the sole Zumba. -er. So, yeah, we have There's a problem. She has dresses out here. There's going to be a naked lady running by. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, we are, we had a long beach day. We got coconuts. Pro tip, don't drink the coconut water. It's not yummy. Um, but they're really fun for photos. And, yeah, so we are going to, we're just back to change quick. It's like 5.30. We're gonna go for a walk on the beach, our nightly walk, which we missed yesterday. Because someone had food poisoning. Um, but then I'm gonna do a room tour because we didn't, we're not working with this hotel or anything. It's just fun to see because it's actually, we're super impressed by this room. And we stay at a lot of hotels. And yeah. this is one of probably the, like, it's like the nicest room setup. I don't know. It's really nice. The room setup is really good. Concept. So there's a couch. Guess but also like all divided. Yeah, it's cool. I really love it. And I love that there's a balcony too, which is super nice. Because we can sit out there at night, in the morning. I haven't been sitting out there in the morning though. Because I've been like going for a walk and then going to breakfast. Alright, I'm ready. Do I have okay. our undies? No. Going to take some photos. Our nightly walk. Our nightly walk. It's beautiful this time of day. Like, just beautiful. So, yeah. We are going to uh, walk the beach, maybe get a drink to take with maybe. us. That's our usual routine. Last night, it's such a routine that Allie, even though I was sick, actually brought me back the drink still. She was like, I asked for two by accident. I went alone. It was, it was nice still, but I missed you, I guess. You guess? Yeah. 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 Do rosé. Cheers, me. And the ocean. There is so much beach to walk on. There is. Because, yeah. normally. Oh, wow, yeah. Look. So, typically what we do, or what Allie does, I don't do this, is she gets up and goes and picks a seat on the beach. Right? Yeah. Because otherwise, if you don't come early, you just won't get a seat. But today, there's lots of people that have already come and claimed Yeah, theirs. I think we don't have our spot. I guess everyone wants to be on the beach today. Because yeah. normally. Oh wow, yeah. Look. So typically what we do, or what Allie does, I don't do this, is she gets up 
and goes and picks the seat on the beach. Right? Yeah. Because otherwise, if you don't come early, you just won't get a seat. But today, there's lots of people that have already come and claimed for Yeah, this. I think we don't have a... Good morning. So, today's our last full day here. Um, oh, I slept in a break, so that is a little crazy. But, um, yeah, so I just, I set my alarm for 7.30 this morning so I could fully enjoy the day. I thought it was going to rain, but it's actually, it looks like it's going to be beautiful. I do went to a Italian restaurant last night, it was really yummy, and then they had a magic show, which is super fun. Um, but today I'm going to actually bring my camera and vlog all day. Since it's our last day, um, yeah, we really took the, bleh, we really took the time to relax and kind of unplug so this is yeah i feel ready to pick up the camera i'll remember today and yeah so i am up early having my coffee and sam is awake she woke up with my alarm but she's still cozy in bed all right so so it is super super hot it's so hot i'm dying and it's like 9 a.m and it was supposed to not be a nice day, so... Yeah, it was supposed to rain. Knock on wood. And thunder, so... It's nice. Amazing. Alright, the wife is up. Oh! She got up with me. I did. She's Can gonna. You, do you want my swimsuit though? Yeah, how? I did get up with you because you set an alarm. I did. Here, hold the vlog. Um, so we're gonna go for a walk on the beach and then get our spot with our towels. We're gonna go for a we're walk. We're gonna get a good beach. spot today, I bet, because we're up early. We're up so early. I'm going to charge this while we're out. So, here we go. Another day under the beach vlog. <laughs> Hello folks, it is our last morning. We are flying out today and I got up early at seven and I went for a walk. Well, I had my coffee outside and I went for a walk. Um, so I'm waiting for Sam to go to breakfast. So we'll take you with us. Um, I wanted to show you the room quickly once she's done in the bathroom. And I also wanted to show you these undies that were actually a lifesaver on this trip. So I started trying the period in these this year and they're really great. So I don't really like wearing pads because obviously bleach, bad stuff, yucky, hassle. Um, and I was using the Diva Cup, but I find it hurts now. So um, the period of these, yeah? Anyways, so these ones are Lilova. Uh, this is how you spell it. Lilova. I don't know if you can see that. Undies. Um, I'm going to show you the two nude pairs that I have. These two styles. This one is a little bit of, not high waisted, but like it kind of goes high waisted because of the lace. And then this one is just like hip length, hip height, hip huggers. Um, and then I have a black pair that I will show you after. I didn't bring them on the trip. They're high waisted. Um, 
and they're really good. I love high waisted, so those are my favorite ones. And I like that they're black. Um, but these are awesome. They hold four tampons worth. So on the plane ride here, I wore them, and I didn't have to worry about getting up to go to the bathroom during the trip to change anything because this holds a lot of blood. <laughs> Um, it's also great. Yeah, just all the time. Anyway, a lot of people are like, ew, is it gross? What's it like? It is not gross. I don't find it gross anyway. Um, I find they just feel like regular undies and it feels a lot less gross than a pad because it's not sticky. It's like cotton material. It's a normal material. Um, and I have a question. Yeah. Does it feel like you're sitting in blood? It does not feel like you're sitting in blood. The undies soak it up really, really well. I find, yeah, like I said, it's a, a pad feels more like sitting in blood to me. Um, and a lot of people are also asking about washing it, which I was my concern too. Like, ew, what do you do with it? So you just rinse it out after you wear them, like rinse them out in sink. And then I hang them to dry. And then whenever I'm doing the next load of laundry, you just throw them in and then hang them up to dry. So don't put them in the dryer. So it's so easy it's not gross at all um yeah anyway these are the two this well these are the two that i really like um but i will show you the high-waisted ones when we get home because i like that they're black i prefer the black color they do have some other colors um i think most of them have like lace so they they're not like ugly styles which is nice too anyway i wanted to show you those because I put them in the story and a lot of people are asking so i also wanted to show you the room this is our room our balcony, nice little desk, the bed, I like that it's two levels, nice big pull-out couch, so if we had more people, we have a pull-out couch, all of our suitcases, nice big mirror, which is always good, check out the tan lines, I think she's naked in here, I am naked in never here. mind, can't show you the bathroom, anyway, this is our room, double shower, double shower heads, which is really nice too. Anyway, I'm going to take you to breakfast, I guess, and get her to hurry up so we can eat. Breakfast vibes today is on the beach. I know, it's perfect. It's so nice. What a way to leave. I still have an upset stomach, so potatoes. I might try to eat a churro. Not eating coffee. Drinking coffee, that's always. I got a lot of stuff, but... Oh, yeah. Look at that cheese slice. <laughs> it's on eggs. It looks like mm, the cheese is so good. You like their cheese a lot, eh? Alright, so we had breakfast and we are all packed up. And we're gonna go ahead and we're check leaving. out. We're leaving. It's so sad. It went by so fast. Anyways. It really doesn't it really doesn't feel like we've been here for an entire week. It feels like week. two days. We'll buy so quick. It was good. So was this really was good. our first vacation with like absolutely zero work. I'm gonna check around the room. <laughs> Just check the bathroom. There is some stuff in there that you might oh, yeah, there is. want. So I'm gonna bring it. Um, this is our first actual vacation in like three years. Meaning really no work. We didn't have any photos to take that we needed to. We didn't have to promote any hotels or absolutely anything. So it was good. It was really relaxing. It was nice to just be able to do whatever we want because a lot of the times when we travel for work, it's amazing. It's the best experience, but our itineraries are planned out and they're very full. So this being just like time with friends and relaxing yeah, with relaxing. absolutely nothing we to do. do we, we, we didn't leave the nothing. resort, which we has never even, happened. We like sat at the beach and we barely even spoke. Like we just like, we barely spoke. Yeah. <laughs> we were just like chilling. We just read books. I read three books. Like didn't do anything. Yeah. It was really nice. Same with our friends. Like we yeah. all just sat there and read. We just like sat there. We talked to like dinner. We went to dinner yeah. every night and every, we went for lunch. We went for every meal together, basically. That's what Jan was saying last night. She's like, we actually spent like pretty much all of the days together, but I feel like, like we, you're the only people I could spend all day every day with. Cause we did. I feel like I spent any time with you. We did spend, so. we spent all day every day. But we just, it's cause we don't, we didn't have to talk. It's like, they're not exhausting. Yeah. You don't have to talk. You can just 
We were here with another lesbian couple. You bought it? Yeah. Also, Allie's best friend. Yeah, it's my best friend. <laughs> Her long-time best friend. Um, also a lesbian. Also a lesbian. She was in our wedding. But yeah, so it was a really relaxing trip. I'm really, really happy about it. I think we need to do this again. Yeah. I feel like especially once we have kids, I want to travel so, so much with them. But I also think that we need to do like one trip a year without them. That's like this kind of trip where we do nothing and just like recharge and hang out. Because got to keep those batteries high. I'm anticipating. That's okay. <laughs> Oh, okay, well, bye. And in case you were wondering, we stayed at the Paradisis um, here in Punta Cana. It was lovely. The staff was so nice. I think that was the like best part. Well, we walked a lot, so we saw a lot of other resorts from the beach. And uh, the Paradisis by far has the best, best beach. beach. Like For the sure. best beach. The most beachfront. Yeah. And then they have like, you'll see in the videos, but they have those little tiki huts at every single spot for people yeah which nowhere else i think one other place has and that was really nice the pool is humongous so even though it's there's so many people there it really didn't feel that busy say goodbye no it's bye it's a quinta cana also cute little airport